guys and welcome back to another video and today we are going to go to my trainer Leonie Browns for a lesson and I'm going to try out my new VIP pad so I decided to put Luca in the shop because he doesn't always get to go in a video but there's Luca what do you think of the VIP pad Luca he says I don't know because I haven't tried it anyway so yeah so I've just started a new partnership with VIP and I'm going to be having a go at using their pad today in one of my lessons. I thought it would be a really good um, video to do because today I'm going to be working on the um, elasticity in the trot and the engagement and it's quite hard to get Leggy to have that bigger trot. So I'm hoping that because he'll be more comfortable, it should be, uh, yeah, it should be good. If you've been keeping up with the videos, you know that we've just stepped up to advanced medium and I'm actually going to back off the flying changes in my lesson today, unless, um, unless I'm just changing the rain, because I don't see a reason to keep practicing them anymore. He is getting better at them, but I feel like I've been neglecting some of my other work a little bit. So like my trot work's gone a bit downhill, so, Oh God, it's just so hard doing everything. Why is dressage all about doing everything? Can't I just have a canter test and then a trot test? No. Anyway, so this is the VIP pad and my normal pad and I'll just uh, let you have a look. Turn the camera around. There you go. So I have the brown one because Leggy wears brown and this is actually a new color. So if you have brown tack like me and you like brown, this is the brown one. And if you look underneath it, it's got like these bubbles, look. And I can squish them, and I can squish them, and I can squish them like this. There you go. Yeah, it's really like bizarre to touch. If you feel it, it's almost like, it's almost like fat and skin. <laughs> I know I'm not like, I'm probably not selling it very well here, but that's what it feels like. It feels really like fatty. And if you put your hand like underneath it like that, it's really comfy and it's like quite cool. So uh, there, hope you get to have a good little, have a look at that. But I'll let you know how I feel about it later on after I've ridden. But I need to get Leggy ready. Not you, one down there. Not you. <laughs>
guys so i have just got home after having my lesson with leone and leggy was amazing um i did feel a difference with the pad i just felt like he was moving a bit more freely over his back so i don't want to say loads and loads to start with because i've only just started trying the pad but i will tell you a few things that i definitely did notice the difference one of them was what i just said about him moving more freely he seemed like he was more willing to take the contact a bit more forward and moving his back better um after i'd finished riding him i ran my hands down his back and normally he's a little bit tight behind the saddle and this time he wasn't at all so that was a big difference but one of the main things that i noticed was that actually when i did his girth up to start with normally when i put his saddle on do his girth up he's not naughty but i think because he gets a little bit tight over his back he's just like a little bit like fidgety and a bit uncomfortable but i put his pad on his vip pad and when i did the girth up i noticed that he wasn't so like um fidgety while i was putting the saddle on his back so yeah so so far so good i think at the moment it seems like it's really going to do a good job with him especially because he is a horse that gets quite tight so but i will keep you updated throughout the next few weeks and let you know how i'm getting on with it so pretty much every time i do a vlog i'll give you a little update on how the pad is going but um anyway if you want any more information on the pad i will actually link below um vip equestrian who makes the pads and i'm pretty sure if you have any questions if you want to ask them don't ask me because i'm not <laughs> i'm not 100 up to date on all the knowledge of it but um yeah i'll leave their facebook page below and you can just ask them so yeah if you're interested or just want to ask any questions so anyway guys i hope you've enjoyed the video and as always please subscribe to my channel if you liked it or like the facebook page whatever platform you're watching this on um yeah and give me a comment if you enjoyed it as well so i will see you for the next one